Is that work from home life keeping you from moving around as much as you should? Do you find your energy is down and you feel too tired to work out? Trudy joins us from City Line's LG Kitchen with simple techniques to recharge and get that energy boost that we all crave. Hey, Trudy. Hey, Tracy. How are you? I am great. And you know what I hear from viewers? People are feeling too tired to get moving. Right, exactly, Tracy. You know, working out is probably one of the best ways to increase your energy levels naturally, but if you're too tired to work out and you need some energy, what else can you do? So that's exactly what we're going to be talking about here today. And Tracy, you are so good at keeping on top of exercising and working out. Listen, there are a lot of things I don't do well, but the fitness is something that I'm very committed to because it just it changes the trajectory of my day. So I like getting up early with the dog. It's fantastic. Give us your uh, first tip to help us all out, Trudy. So the first tip would be stress relieving activities. So one of the best things you can do, Tracy, is just to go for a walk on your lunch break. It could just be as simple as 20 or 30 minutes, and that's really gonna give you a bit of an energy boost. But if you absolutely cannot tear yourself away from your desk or your desk chair, then you can just do chair yoga. And yes, I said chair yoga. So all this consists of, Tracy, is just doing a few different yoga moves at your desk chair. So right from the comfort of your desk chair, you don't have to go anywhere. And you can do this in as little as three to five minutes. But this is really gonna help to invigorate both your mind as well as your body, and just to help you to feel more productive and more focused. But you know, but the other thing about the chair yoga too, Tracy, is that it's great for you know, doing when you actually feel that fatigue setting in throughout the afternoon. And you know, speaking of fatigue, Fatigue is actually one of the main symptoms of being stressed out. So chronic fatigue as well as decreased energy levels, that can actually be the result of prolonged stress. And haven't we all felt a lot of that lately? Uh -huh. So during periods of stress, Tracy, I like to make sure that I'm increasing my magnesium intake. And that's why I really like Jameson Liquid Magnesium because it's extra strength for better absorption and it comes in a delicious berry burst flavor. And this is a great way to increase your intake in a fun, more convenient way rather than taking a pill. Oh yeah, it's totally yummy too. So uh, anything to de-stress I think is really good. What do you have for us next in terms of tips? All right, Tracy, so the next one is to hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. And yes, we hear a lot of this, Tracy, but hydration is so important to your energy levels as well as boosting your mood. So the thing about water, Tracy, is that your brain is made up of about three quarters water. So when you don't hydrate enough, your brain actually shrinks in volume. So just kind of picture like a dried out sponge. I know it's probably not the best visual, but <laughs> that's exactly what we're thinking of here. So Tracy, the other thing about water is that you don't always have to drink it. I get it. Drinking water can be boring sometimes. So why not eat it instead? And by eating it, I mean just consuming some fresh fruits and vegetables that are really high in water. So things like watermelon, um, zucchini, as well as cucumbers and grapefruit, these all over have 90% water content. So again, it's a great way to get that hydration in. Now, the other thing you say we need to do uh, after you're hydrating, hydrating is you really need to eat for energy, right? Yes, Tracy, absolutely. We need to eat for energy because food is energy. So we need to kind of start thinking about food differently. Because food is energy, the foods that we eat can actually help to enhance our energy or they may actually drain it. And there's two very important nutrients that your body needs to make sure that you're giving your body that support that it needs. So the first one is vitamin C. And one of the main symptoms of a vitamin C deficiency can actually be fatigue. The other thing about vitamin C, Tracy, is that your adrenal glands that help your body to have a healthy response to stress require a lot of vitamin C to function. So you can get some vitamin C in some foods here. Your diet kind of has to do a little bit of the heavy lifting. So you can get some vitamin C in things like Brussels sprouts, bell peppers, some kiwi. These are all really great sources. But I think one of the easiest ways to make sure you're getting that vitamin C because it's such an important nutrient is to make sure that you're taking a supplement. So I really like this Jameson vitamin C gummies. They come in this delicious orange flavor and are a great source of antioxidants. And that has no artificial colors, no artificial flavors. So it's good to go here. Oh, yeah. Vitamin C is a must. Now, I think you also have B12 on your list. What can you tell us about that? 
Yes, that's right, Tracy. So vitamin B12 is really important for overall immune function, and it also helps your body to metabolize the nutrients from those foods that you're eating that may help to enhance your energy levels. And as you may have heard, vegans are especially at risk for being deficient because one of the best sources are animal foods. So you can find vitamin B12 in things like eggs as well as chicken, but you can also get it in some fermented foods like kimchi and miso and as well as some tempeh. But because it can be a little bit tricky to get through food, that's where a good quality supplement comes in. And I really like Jameson B12 fast melting tablets because they're formulated exclusively with methylcobalamin, which is an advanced form of vitamin B12 that helps it for better absorption and quicker absorption and helps to boost your energy levels naturally faster. Okay, so tons of water. You got to eat right. All great tips you've given us so far. Uh, and I'm loving all those water filled foods as well. You mentioned earlier your last tip. I'm going to do this with you. What are we going to do together, Trudy? Yes, Tracy. And that is to remember to breathe something we often forget when we're tired or during times of stress. So breathing is really important because it helps to balance the oxygen as well as the carbon dioxide in your blood. And that just helps you to make, make you feel a little bit more alert. So are you ready to do this together? I'm ready and I might be in a nap by the time we get to the end of it. So go ahead. Let's start. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. All right. So Tracy, we're going to inhale to a count of two and exhale to a count of two. Then inhale to a count of two and exhale to a count of three. Inhale to a count of two and exhale to a count of four. And you want to keep repeating the sequence, Tracy, for about one minute or until you start to feel the benefits. And sometimes you can feel the benefits in as little as 30 seconds. And the other thing, Tracy, in addition to breathing is sleeping. Sleeping is so important and that's really low hanging fruit. The other thing about sleeping, Tracy, and making sure you're getting adequate amount of sleep is that your ability to make healthy choices can actually impact, get impacted when you don't get enough sleep. So that's why I really like taking Jameson melatonin gummies. And these guys are so fun to eat. They're a great way to help to improve your sleep quality. And they're a safe, natural, non-habit forming sleep aid. And they come in this delicious strawberry flavor. Oh my gosh, give me all the gummies. I love all the vitamins in gummy form. It just makes it kind of fun. Trudy, thank you so much. Great tips. And I almost did dip into a nap there, but I'm awake again. So thank you so much for that. <laughs> <laughs> Good info. Thanks, Tracy. That's and great. we're going to keep it going for everyone at home. Scan the code on your screen right now, and you can become a Jameson Club Health member to receive monthly newsletters on new products tips and recipes. Plus, our friends at Jameson Vitamins want to give two lucky winners a chance to win a $250 Jameson gift card. So go to our website, cityline.tv, to 